evening and welcome to the Junior Awards Ceremony. I am Assistant Principal Danielle Foley and I am honored to be a part of tonight's ceremony to celebrate our junior students who have earned well-deserved recognition. Before we get started, I ask that everyone please rise as the Timberlane High School Chamber Singers perform the National Anthem. Principal John Vacarezza to the stage for his opening remarks. Good evening, everybody. This is a unique time of year because for a lot of the administration and one quarter of the school, we're getting ready to say goodbye to a number of seniors, and there's all these different events going on. And this event's very unique because now we pull in the juniors. We pull you guys in. And what we're going to be doing tonight is not just recognizing the achievements of what you have done in the past, but you guys have an eye on the future. You are the future of Timberlane. You are the future leaders. You are going to be the inspiration for what is to come as you are the class of 2024. And there's a lot of responsibility in being the leaders and the inspiration. I talked to a number of students, I've even talked to them this week, and I said, you know, you impressed me with doing such and such a thing. And this eighth grade kid recognized it. That's a heavy burden that each of you hold. And you hold that because of the achievements that you have already done. But we also want you to keep the eye on the future for what you will become. And that's what this night is about. So we thank you all for what you have done, and again, what you will become. Thank you very much for being Timberlane, and go Owls. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Becaressa. So before we begin our presentation of awards, I would like to give a little direction to the students on how you will receive your awards. For the junior scholars, when you see your name appear on the screen, Please move to the right-hand side of the stage and assemble in alphabetical order along the wall and wait for your name to be called. When your name is called, please walk across the stage to receive your award and continue across the stage to return to your seat. For individual awards, please come to the right-hand side of the stage to receive your award. You may use this stairway here in the front to get to the stage on this side. Everybody got that? Basically, just come this way. 
So tonight we will start by recognizing our junior scholars. These students have earned a cumulative grain point average of 4.0 or even higher after completing five semesters of school. This year, our scholars represent the top 18% of the junior class. I would like to begin by recognizing the top academic leaders of the class of 2024. The top four students in alphabetical order are Julia Jones, Catherine O'Leary, Julia Reynolds, and Caitlin Reynolds. Please help me in congratulating them. I will now read a very long list of excellent names of the juniors who have earned the Junior Scholar Award. Please hold your applause until all distinguished scholars are recognized. So you guys can come on up. If your name is up here, come on up. Line up alphabetically, you can do it. All right. Jacob Andre. Kate Bettys, Ali Billobram, Lily Bryan, Charlotte Caldwell, Jack Condon, Matthew Conti, Alexander Correa. They're really proud of you, Alexander. Gabriella Double. Robert Fairhurst. Julia Fischera. Julia Franck. Angel Galvis. Mark Genest. Connor Goodrow. Evan Houle. Gabrielle and Sarah. Ann Ketchum. Carissa Krotz. Hunter Lejewski. Kirsten McKean. Brooke Morin. Leah Morier. Samantha Oakley. Oluwatumise Oganyankin. John Pagliuso. Kyle Poliquin. Anne Quinn. Isabella Rady. Jacob Raymond. Rachel Roberts. Alexa Salafia. Sophia Sayers. Adam Scanlon. Gina Shaka. Emma Sharp. 
Garrett Schivel. Spencer Sierra. Claire Smith. Jillian Stamley. Owen Sullivan. Callie Susowit. Brielle Walsh. Your great grandmother so proud. Ryan Wills. Please join me in congratulating all of our junior stars. We will now announce our Junior Recognition Awards, beginning with the Junior Book Awards. Every year, colleges and universities seek to recognize outstanding students in local secondary schools. They provide book awards to present to deserving juniors. The award recipients are selected by faculty and staff at the high school based on specific criteria outlined by the college providing the award. Our first book award, the Brandeis Book Award for Social Action and Civic Engagement, is given to an outstanding high school junior in the top 15% of the class who demonstrates a commitment to civic engagement, community service, political activism, social justice, and or volunteer work. This year, the Brandeis Book Award is presented to Leah Morier. Next up is the Clarkson University Achievement and Leadership Award. These are presented to juniors who have strong leadership qualities and positively impact their school and local community. This year, the Clarkson University Achievement and Leadership Awards are presented to the Achievement Award for Oluwatumise Ogunyankin. And the Leadership Award goes to Brielle Walsh. The Rensselaer Mathematics and Science Award is presented to a promising junior who has distinguished themselves in math and science. This award recognizes the excellent academic achievement of young men and women and serves to motivate them toward careers in science, engineering, and technology. The Rensselaer Mathematics and Science Award is presented to Caitlin Reynolds. Next up is the St. Anselm College Book Award, which is presented to a junior who has earned high academic grades in a very competitive curriculum, has an awareness of social responsibility, and possesses strong character. This year, the St. Anselm College Book Award is presented to Julia Frank. The St. Michael's College Book Award recognizes, recognizes one outstanding junior in academics and leadership who demonstrates a sustained commitment to school and community activities. 
This year, the St. The St. Michael's College Book Award is presented to Anne Quimp. The Springfield College Book Award is presented to a junior who demonstrates service to the community and is well-rounded. This student's personal values and aspirations match the mission of Springfield College, which is to educate students in spirit, mind, and body. This year's Springfield College Book Award is presented to Gabriella Double. The Yale Book Award is presented to a junior who has outstanding personal character and leadership skills, provides service to our school and community, and has an intellectual promise and a true passion for knowledge. This year, the Yale Book Award is presented to Catherine O'Leary. Let's give a hand to all of our College Book Award recipients. Next, we will present our Distinguished Junior Awards to acknowledge outstanding students who have been chosen to represent Timberlane at statewide leadership conferences. Each year, the Hobie Award recognizes outstanding students who have demonstrated strong leadership qualities. These students were selected from a pool of students who were nominated by faculty in their sophomore year. Following an application and interview process, two students from the class of 2024 were selected to attend a statewide leadership conference last summer. Each student exhibits the ability and desire to be a positive role model. This year, our recipients were Catherine O'Leary and Spencer Sierra. The New Hampshire Boys State Award is presented to members of the junior class selected by the American Legion, Carl G. Davis Post of Plastow. Students are selected on the basis of leadership, academics, and patriotism to represent Timberlane Regional High School at the annual conferences this summer. The American Legion New Hampshire Boys State Program will be held at St. Anselm College. This year's attendees are William Shanley and Spencer Sierra. The New Hampshire Girls State Award is presented to members of the junior class selected by the New Hampshire American Auxiliary. These students are selected on the basis of leadership, academics, and patriotism to represent Timberlane Regional High School at the annual conferences this summer. This year's recipients are Chase Bishop and Sarah McCrillis.
The Bosch and Loam Science Award is given by the Science Department to an outstanding junior on the basis of his or her academic achievement in science. This year, the Bosch and Loam Science Award is presented to Julia Reynolds. The Southern New Hampshire section of the Society of Women Engineers awards a certificate of merit to, a young, to young women who have demonstrated high achievement in science and mathematics. The recipients have completed at least three years of both science and mathematics with distinction and have been active citizens of the school and or community. By offering this award, the Society of Women Engineers hopes to encourage young women to continue their studies of math and science and possibly enter the engineering profession. This year, the recipients are Julia Jones, Catherine O'Leary, and Anne Quinn. The Ron Hasseltine Challenge Award is presented in memory of a man who embodied everything that is best about the teaching profession. Mr. Hasseltine was a beloved English teacher and coach at Timberlane for many years. While Ron is no longer with us, his memory will never fade in those of us who knew him. It gives me great pleasure to present this award to a student who excels in academics, participates in athletics, and whose positive attitudes toward learning stand out in our school community. This year's award goes to Annie Ketchum. All right, we are on to our final junior award of the evening. Our final award is the Principal's Leadership Award. Principal John Baccarezza will present the award. The Principal's Leadership Award acknowledges juniors who have made outstanding contributions to the school community while exemplifying the, the qualities of leadership embodied in Timberlane's social and civic expectations for all students. This year, the Principal's Leadership Awards are presented to Andrew Augeri and Catherine O'Leary. Congratulations to all of our outstanding juniors. We look forward to seeing you all again next year at our Senior Awards evening. This concludes the Junior Awards ceremony for the evening. Thank you all for coming and please drive safely. Wear your seatbelts. <laughs>